Peace, everybody. From America to Africa, we always find somebody inspirational, somebody doing something new or something positive for the community. So I'd like you to meet this sister who has a very powerful project that she's going to need your help with very soon. So what's your name, sister? My name is Queen Nefertiti. Queen Nefertiti? Yes. And what do you what do you do? You were just telling me about something that you started on 125th Street and it went all the way to Africa and you placed the video on YouTube. It's a concert, actually. Actually, I didn't place the video on YouTube. Actually, I seen it on YouTube. It was a concert with the late and great Joseph Hill from Culture. The late great Joseph Hill from the reggae band Culture. It's 100,000 in Nairobi, Kenya. You can go and view it. They don't tell you who's in back of it or the people who promote it, promote it. But I'm here to tell you that a lot of people in Kenya helped us with that project as far as them promoting it in Kenya. And Papa Bingy was one of the main inspirations of that project. And me, myself. I was the host of the show, but it has nothing about us on that particular video. Okay, so tell me, first of all, how do the people contact you to get more information? Like, what's your email address or what have you? I'm at www.queenynefertiti at facebook.com. And uh, my email is queennefertiti31 at gmail.com. Nefertiti31 at gmail.com. Okay, cool, cool. So, what's going on? You are, you you are bringing out new projects in the near future? Yes, I have a project that I am working with. It is called Who Owns the Battlefield? Who Will Take the Crown? This project is involved with universal rappers and reggae artists. I need help. I would like to have people who's interested in helping the community in Kenya, helping the community in other parts of Africa, so we can take this tour abroad. The, the idea of the concert is hip-hop started in the Bronx. Hip-hop started in New York City. Of course, it went to L.A., Atlanta, and of course, Lil Wayne is definitely holding it down in this day and time. But we would like to see the crown go into Kenya so that the artists can battle the African rappers. We have a host of African rappers that are so very talented in Nairobi, Kenya. So the crown will go into Nairobi, Kenya, and our people from America will come back either to get the crown from the homeland or the crown will stay in the homeland until one or somebody comes and battle for the crown. I do need help. I do need sponsors. I never did this before. I never asked for sponsors before. But this is a dedication to hip hop. This is a dedication to music. This is a dedication to see that artists all throughout the land that have a lot of talent. I can't do it all by myself. I'm just asking for help. Also, I would like to bring in artists like Coco T, some roots and reggae artists, to end the show. Sometimes the artists are charging so much money that it's just unbearable. This is Africa. Children need help. There's a lot of street children in the street. Can't even, they don't have nothing to eat. Walk in the street at seven and six years old. It's time for us to take them. Take the reins. <laughs> take, take, pick up the torch. Pick up the torch and to help our people. And for those who just want to help, please come along with us and do this. It's all I'm asking. Who owns the battlefield? Who will wear the crown? Who owns the battlefield? Is it you? That's I'm Queen Nefertiti. Check me out. I'm here. And the artists. Let's go. Let's do this. That's what's up. I appreciate your time, sis. Your, your information is valuable. You were dropping the jewels on me earlier about the condition of the children in Kenya. I was like, at least we have a sister over here who cares. And you have to realize, you know, you're putting yourself 
in a position to gain great fame, but also great persecution. Because anytime black people tend to reach over in a pan-African type of situation, if you try to improve Africa, you automatically become the enemy of the state. I mean, look how they did Marcus Garvey. All he wanted to do was bring us home. And they have him to this day as a criminal when he should have been exonerated for those things. Things that he didn't really do. So I appreciate you and I hope you get all of the support you need and I will be uploading this to YouTube this weekend. So you be blessed, all right? Yes, thank you so much. And I say peace to the nation and I say peace to everybody out there. And peace to America. This is New York City. Happy Young Labor Day. To all my brothers and sisters, I hope everybody enjoy themselves. Who owns the battlefield? Who will take the crown? Queen Nefertiti. Let's do this. All right, good. The name of this video is Who Will Take the Crown? Peace and blessings. Another banger. Some man pot to yours truly. Peace.